So plenty of changes on the island, but but none really compare, although the bridge is a, is a physical manifest manifestation that you can't ignore. The more subtle things that we've done is improve education at every level, you know. It's quite extraordinary, the primary schools or the first schools as we still call them, how they've changed. The improvements at Queenborough, they've got nursery, they've had an extension. You look at Westminster School, recently opened a £400,000 disabled unit, but has added you know, more and more buildings and more and more facilities for one of the toughest areas in Sheerness. If you look at Rose Street, the first time I went to Rose Street, the headmistress showed me the uh, tide marks from the 1953 and 1976 floods. They were still marked, you could still see them on the wall. The walls were still that damp. All that has gone. Uh, the shore starts, which you know, are wonderful. Uh, and I, you know, we said in 1997, you know, education, education, education. We've still got that to complete on the island with the secondary schools, but we've made a huge investment, and people should not forget how much money has gone in. There's always, as ever, more to do. Uh, but uh, you know, if we can get the secondary education resolved and the 50 million pounds or so invested, for the first time ever, we'll be able to offer. Uh, all the island children, a world-class education, something they've been denied for t far too long in my, in, to my mind.